Hello and welcome back to Bounty Train with Barden. We are here in Milwaukee. We are full of cloth and we're going to be heading to Pittsburgh. So let me see if anyone wants to go with us. Um, from those two, it's a no. Right, so let me grab some of this. So we're bringing a cloth with us in the hopes that um, if Levi needs cloth, we'll have some with us. And if he doesn't, hey, we have some cloth. Um, not today, soldier. Cheers. Okay, anyone going? You're going to Boston. We're not quite going that far. And you're going to Mobile. We're grabbing some coal. to Detroit. Oh yeah, we complete that. Good. Okay. David is going to Montgomery. Jasper is going to St. Louis. We've been down that way a lot, but we're not going that way this time. Um, something I do want to do though is I'm not under time pressure for anything. So it just kind of makes sense to do some, um, get some people healed up and do some repairs as well. Okay, I'm hoping for, no, no hybrid here. Okay. Right, so then we can move on the time. Okay, one more day. So you need to give 30 denim to Jacob. So I'm again. I'm imagining that Levi um, is going to need um, some kind of material from. Oh, we're still waiting for the guys as well. Come on, Stephen, you can do it. Okay, good. Uh, Rasmus, let's put you there. Oh, how did we get Timmy there? Timmy. You there, Stephen. I'm gonna put you there. Everyone's back on board. Good. Going to grab some coal, and I'm gonna see what the story is when we talk to Levi. It's Pittsburgh. Okay, so we made four thousand that month. Not great, and we actually lost money on our trading. But part of that is because we got all of this cloth. We invested money in this cloth, so. So we haven't quite liquidated all of our stocks yet. Okay, now, where is, there's Levi. Hello, sir. What can I do for you? I need denim and ribbits, and lots of it. Mr. Jacob Davis. Can you help me out with this? For Mr. Jacob Davis. Sure, if you bring me enough cotton, I'll pay $300 per crate. I can do that. Yeah, so I was speculating whether it was going to be cotton because cotton is generally used for denim, but then because the cloth was said it was made from cotton, I thought maybe that's what he wants. But okay, so to bring him cotton, we can do that. Okay, so five cloth will be one denim. Okay, or five cotton will be one denim. Right, well, let's buy all of that. And then have another chat with him. I brought you cotton. Give him that. 
Okay, Levi's current stock is two pieces. Okay, so we need to get him to five. But he needs 30 denim. And then it's going to be 30 denim to make 10 sets of jeans. Okay, so yeah, this is going to be a long thing to do, I think. Now, um, let's see, let's wait for you to open and see if you need a supply of cloth. You need supply run of oil. You need furs, liver St. Paul. Oil to Detroit. Okay, I'm gonna check those out later. We're gonna uh, hopefully take profit. Yeah, decent profit there on that. Now, we're on the hunt for cotton. So, Cincinnati has lots of cotton for pretty cheap. Indianapolis has cotton too. Cleveland has cotton as well. Yeah, so there's plenty of places we can go to to get cotton. So, first of all, we're thinking Cincinnati is the place to go. So, let's map our way there. I think it's maybe just a straight run in. Yeah, it's a straight run in. So, what do we then bring from Pittsburgh to Cincinnati? Steel. Tobacco. Guns. Okay. Yeah, let's go with uh, guns and tobacco. And these these are denim. Current oh, so he's produced five of those that we can take. Okay, do they take up one? They do. So we're going to wait until we have them all and then just bring them all there. Right, so we were going to bring guns. Wait, guns are not illegal there, right? I don't believe they are. No, they're not good. Right, so, yeah. Um, let's get two tons of this before we start mucking about with anything else. Okay, so 22 is as many as we yeah. And then it doesn't leave much room for the tobacco. We still get six tobacco on though. So we do that. Check if anybody wants to go to Cincinnati, probably not. It's always worth checking. Right, so off to Cincinnati we go. Okay, I'm going to wait for City Hall to open. See, you need a supply run of medicine. And other than that, we're not interested in any other things that you had, so let's just sell this stuff. Sell that. Let's buy those. Okay, uh, grab ourselves a ton of coal. Check in the station, you're going to New York, and she's going to Wilmington, okay. Then we get ourselves back to Pittsburgh. Talk to Levi again, I brought you some cotton, here's the rest of the cotton. Okay, so now he has produced 10 denim, so that's one third of the way done. Uh, so we move those to here. Okay, good. Then let's think. Next place for cotton. That's, that needs to be our focus. Indianapolis is 18. And Cleveland is 24. Louisville is 23. Washington is 37. New York is 37. Okay, so Indianapolis and Cleveland and Louisville. So Indianapolis is to the west. Um, Louisville is further west again. So it's kind of a choice between those two, really. Unless you want to go 
kind of Cincinnati and gonna go off there to both we could do that we could go Cincinnati to Indianapolis buy the cotton there bring it back to Cincinnati and then go to Louisville buy all the cotton there and bring that back to Cincinnati again then we'd make one trip and then come back for another lot in the hope that Cincinnati then replenishes its stock of cotton as well um, yeah that's not a bad idea so then we just need to work out what we bring so we already went to Cincinnati so it's basically what we're going to bring to either Cincinnati or to Indianapolis to sell so Cincinnati is going to be steel now it's Indianapolis Could be farms. Yeah, that might be a good shout there. Yeah, so let's go. Let's go seven firearms and then as much steel as we can get. And then if we want, we can fill out with tobacco. So we purchase the weapons and purchase, uh, actually purchase our coal, then purchase as many of these as we can get, just 12, and then fill out with as many of these as we can get, which is four, okay? Then get ourselves to Cincinnati. Check City Hall again. You want? You still want medicine? We may. We might be able to do that at some stage, but not right now. The weapons. Let's see. Selling the weapons where is the best idea? In Indianapolis. Okay, so we do that. Then from here to Indianapolis. Um, probably fur is the other thing that we bring. Okay, and then let's buy this cotton. Let's sell the steel. Okay, um, sell this tobacco. Fill up on fur. Check if anybody wants to go to Indianapolis. Nope, okay, and then let's hope that 1.1 tons is enough. It should be, it's right there. Sir, you won't find better prices anywhere else. Uh, no, thank you for the first shopping in the city. Because my train is full of stuff already, so yeah, it wouldn't really be worth it to us. Okay, then I'm gonna wait for City Hall to open. You supply run of um, oil and then deliveries to Jacksonville, Knoxville, Omaha, St. Paul. We're not going to be able to take care of any of those for you. We're going to sell the weapons though. Sell the fur. Okay, buy the cotton. Uh, fill out with tobacco. Oh, wait. Medicine. So we we'll buy some medicine. Don't think it's quite as much as they needed. But at least we can drop it off there and be working towards that. And get some coal. You're going to St. Paul. Buffalo. Cincinnati. Um, we could get you if you have to come back again. But right now, we're just kind of full up. Let's get back to Cincinnati. I want to check actually how, how much medicine they needed. Because you could actually do it. You need 25 units of medicine. Okay. So we don't quite have enough of that. Let's drop the cotton off there. 
Let's drop the medicine there. Okay. So what we're going to do then is we'll buy this other cup as well. What we're going to do is we're going to go to Louisville and buy the cotton there. Then probably make another trip back to Indianapolis to buy whatever cotton has replenished there as well. And to get some more uh, medicine. Okay, so, so next we want to go to Louisville. So we need to plan cloth yeah cloth just bring cloth so let's get as much cloth as we can nobody wants to go to Louisville I'm pretty sure I think one of you wants to go to New York yeah you did and I can't remember Wilmington or somewhere like that yeah Wilmington okay. we're off to Louisville Maybe wait for it to open again. Maybe you need cloth. You need supply on steel. Okay, and then your deliveries. The Milwaukee one is interesting. This oil one would be great if <laughs> if we could carry 31 units. I'd definitely jump on the money for that. But hey, what can you do? Right, let's sell all of that. Let's then Okay, let's see. Let's be a little strategic here, so... Just 27 of that. Oh, that's not the one I want. It's this one. Okay. So 12 units there. We need to get another 13. And then we buy that much cotton. So it means that we can actually let cotton replenish again here. Oh, damn, we need coal. But it means we can we can still be making money because, you know, we're basically donating this cotton to him. I know he is giving us a final product, but the final product isn't something that we're going to be able to sell. Okay, so... We grab our coal and then check on people here. Des Moines, Omaha, wow. They want to go to our part of the world, but unfortunately we don't need to go to our parts of the world at the moment. What was the thing you needed? You needed steel. So we might actually come back with that at some point. We'll have to see though. Let's get to Cincinnati because Pittsburgh has lots of steel, I think. Cincinnati might have some steel as well. Pittsburgh, yeah, Pittsburgh Steelers kind of tells me that they probably do have um, steel there. But then let's wait for you to open. Uh, we'll accept that and then we'll complete it straight away. Great. Then we go to the market. You have seven steel. Uh, we're going to move cotton and buy some more cotton as well gonna grab some of this we're now going to Cincinnati so is there anyone here who is going to Cincinnati New York and Wilmington right yeah so the Cincinnati person was in Indianapolis I think so that's a little bit unlucky let's get back to Pittsburgh so some nice, um, some nice um, places to get some cotton, which is great. Uh, Levi, let's talk to you again. We brought you some more cotton, buddy. There you go. Okay, so, and that's done too. So he's now produced 16 denim, which is great. six of the train for the moment. I'm going to buy another cotton and give it to him. Now we have 17 denim. OK, 
Okay, so we have 13 more denim. Yeah, so. So we need to do. Let's think about this. Five cotton produces one denim. So, in order to get, we need to get 30 denim. So we have 13 more. So that is 65, is it? Yeah, that's 65 more cotton that we need to bring. We only have three more spots here. Um, so what we might have to do is, the next load of cotton that we bring, we're probably going to have to then ship the denim um, to Jacob to do that. Um, so yeah, we're going to have to think about that. But for now, that is the end of this one. So I hope you have enjoyed and I hope to see you all next time. Goodbye. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, maybe consider hitting the subscribe button there on the right or checking out some other videos here on the left. Or perhaps you might even share with some friends.